guys, it is Subaki Swag and I'm coming to you with my review of Log Horizon Episode 18, Expeditionary Force. Okay, so this episode, like it's still, Log Horizon is still moving kind of slow right now and I'm sorry that this is late, this should have been up on Saturday, but things happen so I'm still putting it up regardless of whether I get any views or not. So, this episode, pretty much, long story short, Princess Lanessa came to Akinabara to pretty much make a plea to the people of the land, asking them for help because Yamata, the like country in which she lives, is in dire straits right now. And Izumo knights have vanished and there is no one there, like there's no one left to protect the people of the land within Yamato. So she has come to Akinabara with Krusty and Shiro and um, Akatsuki to make a plea to the people of the land to ask them to help her and she will fight alongside them as well and I personally like her new get up it, it fits her even though she felt like she looked um, disgraceful showing pretty much showing more skin than she's normally used to but it fits her I like it it's, it makes her look more beautiful but anyways so as she was playing to them at first she didn't think that anybody was gonna help and then it turns out that everyone wanted to help so they got it looks like over I want to say around 2,000 people helping or more so she her plea was well heard and she was stressing over nothing but it turns out that in a way she did disgrace her grandfather and the Cohen family for the way she interrupted their meeting and then kind of ran off to do her own bidding so the grandfather um, Cohen is left there to pretty much mend things for her and he was talking to the uh, the people left in the round that were there for the round table meeting and pretty much long story short they said that they were gonna wait until Shori got there Shiro got there to make any final decisions because they can't do it without him because he is the leader of the round table so um Cohen pretty much said that he was gonna let Lanessa fix her own problems so seems like and then also everyone that is in the um, that were in the training camps were successful in helping the cities around the area um, be safe from the goblin attacks so that's another good thing but also I'm still like I still feel like there is something a little off about Rudy because there was a part at the very end when Rudy was talking about so this this is what it's like being an adventurer and um, um, Zuzu was like just said his name and then this like it cut away to um, Krusty talking to everyone aboard the ship as they were on their way to fight the goblins but I still feel like there's something about Rudy that's hidden and I've kind of already been spoiled but I would love to hear what y'all think like is up with Rudy do you think he's a person of the land is he just is there, there's something off about him <clears throat> but it looks like things are going to start turning up now because it seems like Lady Vanessa is going to have to step her game up and Krusty and Shiro and Akatsuki are going to be fighting alongside her so I'm kind of looking forward to see seeing the next episode this weekend but I would love to hear what y'all think is going to happen next. Do you think something bad is going to happen to Lanessa? Do you think that her country is going to be 
is going to be safe now because all the um, adventures of Akinabara are helping her. What do you guys think? But as always, please, please, please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. And this is Subaki Swag saying adios.